Lord Balmoral, what guts and courage has he really shown to take our one of our features this afternoon, the sprinting feature? Em, you and him go a long way back. You've known him from before he relocated here. You said he's got talent, but he's got to bring it on the day, and that's what he's done. Yeah, most definitely, Nadine. Um, as I said, he's a talent. I know his old history. I think he, he got travel sickness going to Durban. Never had a great season. He had one win, then he came back, and then I fell off him, and he ran into the wall at Kenilworth. And so he's had ability, but unfortunately he cups in that. And I must just commend uh, Duncan the last couple of months when he came here and he's changed something in his in his yard and the horses have really looked very well. I mean, every horse of his in, in the ring looked fantastic and he's done a great job. So well done to him. I mean, it's, it's worked out and let's hope it, it, con it continues. I do agree that perhaps with him looking to have lost his early speed, Dunks tried a bit further, but I think in that respect he's done a cracking job cutting back to a distance. This guy's only trying for the second time and uh, winning a feature. Yeah, most definitely. I think some of that problem is mine. I always thought he might go a mile, but yeah, it hasn't worked out. And today it was just a try. I put blinkers on him and they went very quick. There's a nice wind and I went and looked for the cover and halfway through the race I was like, oh, we got a chance here. He started feeling very good underneath me and just rode him with the hands. And when I asked him, he really kicked well and 100 out. I thought, oh, we'll win this. Well, M, very, very well done. Uh, Dunk's having a great day. Second on the day, lifts one of the features. You're involved. Congrats. Yeah, thank you. Um, and Dunk, she said, well done to Mr. Truter, and, and they're very patient. And Mrs. Truter, I really love the horses, and it's nice to send yes. Duncan some horses, and he looks after them well, so they've got the results. To my sponsor, Aventia, thank you very much, guys. They're re really doing a great job. There were some lovely specials on Black Friday today at the farm, <laughs> so if anyone is in Cape Town, go, go please and support them. Thank you very much. Very well done. Cheers. There you go, that's MJ Bailefelder and steering home Lord Balmoral to take our feature. And our feature is the 43rd Air School Glendore Sprint. So with that, I'd like to call Cameron Easton in to join me, an instructor from Port Alfred. Great to have you here. And tell us a little bit about 43rd Air School. Well, thank you very much for having us. And uh, we're here on the day to support the South African Air Force, uh, just showing our support for them. And to chat a bit about 43. Uh, we're based in Port Alfred, one of the biggest training organizations okay. in, in Africa, I'd say. Wow. Uh, offering a huge, huge, huge array, uh, well, array of aviation courses from yeah. maintenance to APHIS to obviously our best course, the integrated ATP, and then moving on to type rating. And lots, lots, lots to come from 43, making a move into Europe now, and uh, cabin crew training on its way. Okay. It's massive. So are those your, your new features for 2019? Right, the new features, we've got some of them in already this year. Okay. Um, but new facilities, upgraded accommodation, really, really top class stuff. And uh, yeah, we have students from all over the world who choose 43, and we definitely do provide for them. Uh, with, again, one of the biggest training organizations in Africa, now making our footprint into Europe. So I think we are definitely one of the first to go and do that. Well, all the interest, everything happening, people getting excited, how do they get hold of you? So obviously social media is a big part of marketing in, in these days. Uh, Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook, mm -hmm. internet. Go like, okay. subscribe. There's a YouTube channel now where we interview some of the students and just get a word from their mouth. And uh, yeah, email. If anyone is ever interested, and I'm sure they will be, book an intro flight to Port Alfred. Go and see it for yourself, yeah. hands and feel, and just get the full experience. Well, it's been great having you here. Great to have you involved today in, uh, in the, the annual fundraiser. Thanks very much for the feedback, and well done. The Glendor Sprint was an absolute cracker. I'm sure you're happy to be involved in that one. Definitely. Thank you very much, ma'am. Thank you. That's Cameron Easton from 43rd Air School, the Glendor Sprint, one of our features this afternoon, really humdinger of a race, very exciting, and from everything I've heard about 43rd Air School, very exciting there as well. So you've heard how to make contact. Do it if uh, it interests you. It does sound really, really exciting. Back to Duncan McKenzie, though, trainer here of Lord Balmoral. I think he's done a cracking job. Lord Balmoral now lifting his fifth career victory. Very well done to Mr. and Mrs. Truter. He's really done you proud this afternoon. Race five now, Auckland.